guys, I have a quick little review, um, a combo of different products and one product that actually was recommended by some of my viewers or subscribers and um, let me just quickly get into the first product. I got given um, an amazing gift by um, someone very special and one of the things that was included is is this um, hand cream by Aesop and it's called Resurrection Aromat Aromatique Hand Balm and it has mandarin rind, rosemary leaf and cedarwood atlas um, and it says that it will transform even the most abused and life weary hands. Um, I have to tell you that this is the most beautiful earthy scent it feels amazing um it's an um, it's a great size because it's like not too big to take with you on the go but at the same time it's not tiny so it's gonna last me a long time um some of the primary ingredients include sweet almond oil mandarin orange peel oil lavender oil cocoa butter um grapefruit seed extract, wheat germ oil, and I, carrot root extract, pretty cool. I've never used this company, Aesop. I believe that they are out of Australia, and so if anybody can recommend other products by this brand that I should try, please let me know because I couldn't be more into this hand cream. I love everything about it. Uh, next up is is another product I love everything about and um, it's a bath and shower oil by Aromatherapy Associates and it's called Relax Deep. I've used it three times and you can see how much use there has been. They recommend to just um, use a cap full in your bath and this is how much it's you don't need that much the um, the scent is again very earthy, very um, natural. It's not sweet at all, so you kind of need to appreciate the more earthy. Um, let's see, like for example, it has patchouli oil, um, sandalwood oil, camphor. Um, so it's along that sort of natural, warmish herbal fragrance, but I can tell you that each time that I've had a bath with this oil, um, I've come out feeling completely, completely relaxed and refreshed, and I haven't yet used it. There's two ways, so I've only put it in my bath, but I just saw and it reminded me that there's a different way I can use it so maybe I'll, I'll give a little update that if you want to use it as a shower oil you smooth it over your body before you get into the shower and then you wash it off and probably co combined I'm guessing combined with the, the heat of the water maybe the scent will start to like fill the air I'm gonna do that really soon and I'll report back um, but the main the primary oil is coconut oil and then vertiver oil. So I've never really heard of vert vertiver. It's spelled V E T I V E R T. So um, 10 out of 10 product. This was part of my gift. So these two things, I'm not sure how much they cost. So look them up. But I definitely got spoiled. Um, Another item included in my gift is this Aveda Caribbean Therapy body scrub and it has salt and Caribbean or Caribbean some people say cane sugar and I've reviewed um, scrubs before and I've always said that the Sun Body Scrubs are my absolute favorite and I always talk about an oily film that's at the top of most other scrubs and here's a classic example of how the oil, I'm doing such a bad job, hope I'm not making anyone dizzy, um, how the oil kind of separates from the product and it's so not a big deal to just, if you're going to use you know, your hand anyways to scoop it out and rub it 
on your body, it's not a big deal to just work it into the product first, but it's an added bonus that the somebody salt and sugar scrubs you don't have to do that with. But let me tell you something. This scrub um, smells exactly like you would think the Caribbean therapy would be coconutty, pineapple, summer sort of fragrance and it has salt, aloe leaf extract, sugarcane extract, avocado oil, passion fruit extract, ginger root powder, coconut oil, cocoa seed butter, mango seed butter, vitamin E, and then fragrance. And um, it's a phenomenal scrub. It leaves your skin, it's, it's pretty gritty, so if you have too sensitive of a skin, I wouldn't recommend it. Um, but it smells incredible. It leaves your skin super slick. I'm talking like the most oily scrub I've ever tried, but in a very good way. So maybe for the extra, extra, extra um, dry days. Uh, the one thing I have to tell you, which is such a um, downside, is you can see that this product, it's it's a big jar. So when you buy it or you get given it, you expect it to be, you know, it's going to last you a really long time. It has 15.8 ounces. It came with a seal at the top. So I peeled back the seal and it was probably, it only starts a third of the way down. So there's like this much air, which is frustrating. Um, but Besides that, no complaints. And then the last product is from a company called Bubble and Bee Organic. And it is a product that, if, like, over time, um, su subscribers have recommended to me. And I went ahead and ordered it online through the website. And I ordered it in coconut and lime. And... First of all, let's let's look at the ingredients. Um, shea butter, coconut oil, jojoba oil, sweet almond oil, macadamia nut oil, organic coconut extract, and organic lime extract. It's 100% organic. This is the thing about this product. First of all, I'm obsessed and I love it. But I, the first time I used it, I was like, oh, that's interesting. And then ever since I used it once, it almost becomes addictive. I hope you can see the sun is it's in such a bad way. Um, but the reason why I was so unsure to begin with is because of the the consistency. It's it's almost like a chapstick consistency at first, but with the warmth of your body, it starts to melt and it starts to hydrate and it starts to fill um, the room, not just your body, with the most unbelievable, gorgeous smell. Um, there were other fragrances available, but I went with the coconut vanilla, and it leaves your skin looking um, that like that glistening sort of hydrated way that I love. And their packaging is so cute. It's it's um, basically it says now with extra organic attitude, no bad stuff, and I have no bad stuff to say about this. I thank my subscribers who um, recommended this product. The only downside is that I would have expected for $22 maybe to get a bigger tub, but a little bit goes a long way. So um, I, I will continue to use it and um, probably reorder because it's, it's got a very special sort of feel to it and I think it's perfect for summer but also perfect for winter because it has such highly um, moisturizing ingredients so please keep the suggestions coming my way because I do um, read all of the, the comments and most of the time I respond and I do go out and and purchase products that get suggested and um, so yeah continue to do that that way I can learn about new things and you guys can learn about new things and we'll create like a great um, little community that um, respects and gives attention to maybe the littler companies that that um, are natural so anyways 
There you go. Bye, guys.